Update on the story concerning the Chinese Beijing Winter Olympics. Justin Trudeau uh, also joined in the diplomatic boycott of the Chinese Olympics. Really getting super bad vibe for what's going on right now. Um, you know, first they tried to claim Eufer, and once the king of the Lib Turds completely annihilated them about human rights uh, concerning the Eufers, pointing out the sterilization of 20,000 California female inmates against their will. Daily shootings of black people by the police. MK Ultra, the fact that China has universal health care, and the way that the Chinese government has been improving the life for their citizens, improving their Gini score, while at the same time raising measurements of upward mobility while the United States were in a backslide. All the numbers are working in the opposite way. After the king of the lib turds made them look like a bunch of fool, they're like cornered animals now. And uh, even CNN joined in the fun here. Now they're saying, okay, freedom of the press, okay? Specifically a story about Apple Daily. Here's the thing, Apple Daily is a tabloid style newspaper. That's the same way Rupert Murdoch started out. In 2020, they were supporting Donald Trump. And they're a big time uh, pro-democracy outlet. So basically because China won't switch their style of government, everybody's mad at them. While at the same time, the radical right neo-Nazis in America want us to change to be more like China. Make up your damn minds. Kind of funny how they change their beliefs based on who it's coming from, huh? The newspaper also ran a bunch of stuff about Hunter Biden. So basically what's going on here is some American Americans thought they could have the freedom to lie. The freedom to ruin a country like Fox News, Facebook, OAN, etc. have ruined America. If you ask me, this was probably the Americans trying to cause problems in China. That's how they operate with the CIA creating revolutions on social media in foreign countries. Pushing Hong Kong to rebel. But everybody's butthurt because China wasn't dumb enough to fall for it. Whereas the dumb Americans just allowed Fox to totally ruin the country, push it to the brink of a civil war. Just so ironic that America's being pushed to authoritarianism and fascism, and they're complaining because they can't make China a democracy. What a joke. And can you just imagine some other countries like, hey, you need to let Hawaii become a part of some other nation. We're gonna boycott your Olympics, and also, also, uh, we created a bunch of social media and newspapers to try to cause a revolution in Hawaii. 